This tutorial is for users wanting to create a BibTeX file for LaTeX documents from their Mendeley Reference Manager. Mendeley integrates easily with LaTeX and creates an automatically syncing BibTeX file. This means that any changes made in Mendeley will immediately be reflected in the BibTeX document. To begin, we first need to open our Mendeley Reference Manager. Next, create a library under the My Library tab. Here's one I created earlier. I've called it LaTeX and it contains three references. Next, we head to the Tools tab and then select Options from the drop down list. Select BibTeX tab from the headings. Then we need to make sure that the Escape LaTeX Special Characters box is ticked. To create an automatically syncing file, tick the Enable BibTeX Syncing box, then select Create one BibTeX file per group. Next is the most important step. To ensure our LaTeX document can read our saved BibTeX file, we need to save this file into the same folder as our LaTeX document. To do this, press the Browse button, then select the folder that contains your LaTeX document as the destination. Mine is saved in a folder called Basic, which is saved onto my desktop. Next, press Apply, then OK. Let's minimise Mendeley to see our saved BibTeX file. As I mentioned previously, it will be in my basic folder on my desktop. The BibTeX file will be saved with the extension .bib and have the same name as your library within Mendeley. Mine was LaTeX. Now let's double click to open the BibTeX file. As you can see, it has been saved in BibTeX format where each reference begins with an at symbol, followed by the format type of the reference and the citation key. These will then be followed by the extra information contained within each reference. Next, let's investigate the automatically syncing option by heading back to our Mendeley Reference Manager. Firstly, I'm going to make up a new reference for the LaTeX library. Then we'll need to press the sync button so that the BibTeX file will be informed of any changes made in the Mendeley Reference Manager. Now let's head back to the latex.bib file in my basic folder. As you can see, we now have our new fourth reference. Thank you for watching this tutorial on Mendeley Reference Managers and BibTeX. For any more questions regarding Mendeley, BibTeX or LaTeX, please see the Managing Reference in LaTeX LibGuide or contact your school's liaison librarian.